Hello ladies and gentlemen, Honest Fan back here, and today is another episode of Indie Games of the Week. Today we I play Super Hexagon. This review will be short because there's not too much to talk about it, but Super Hexagon is a very good indie game. I think during Christmas sales on sale for like 59 cents. That's when I got it, it was a steal. Uh, it's a really good game, just, just basically play to kind of screw around. You got different levels, and... You gotta complete them. It is a very hard game. You gotta complete it because you got the level of the hexagon and the pentagon, then which is line, and you got the triangle, and then you get the square. I always get stuck at the square. That's where I can get up to. And yeah, it's 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 pretty hard. It, it it's kind of a flash game. I guess you can kind of define it as a flash game. That's what I would say. But anyways, here is the showing. Again. Basically you just use the arrow keys on the keyboard, that's how you play it. Game See over what I mean? Again. Such a bitch. Game over again. Dude, I'm so close. Game over again. Got good music. That's what the game is renowned for too, good music. It's like a contest game like, what over game has better music? Super Hexagon? Or Electron like Super Joy? I still have to say Electron like Super Joy has better music. Oh, I don't even know how to do that. See, now I'm on the line stage. There's not much about this game. Just either having fun. Ryan. Game over again. So close. Um, it gets pretty hard at times, especially like right now. I heard this I made with square. I cannot pass square. Game over it's again. These little, these little mishaps are just being stuck. And yeah, this game. Whoever designed it, I, I, I think it has a Steam description. It's a pretty good game. Oh, it's a song I like. Game over again. But it's a pretty good game. I like it. So I bought it. Well, I was originally trying to save this electronic signature, but I didn't have enough for the time, and I was like, I was like, super I had enough. I was like, why are the balls not? Game over again. And um, yeah. I think the first I made was like 43 seconds. It's pretty hard to do. There's actually achievements, you gotta complete the stages. It's pretty hard to do that though. I haven't been able to do that. Ryan, game over. That one time, we just got to do the spin. Yeah, I clicked the spacebar a lot, because I rage obviously. But, this game's pretty cool. Line. Game over. show for an indie game. Again. It's still pretty good. Game it's just, it's just over. a game if you like want to Again. just waste a bit of time, just screw around and do random shit. This is that type of game. And it's only for Line. PC. But I don't yeah, I wouldn't see it on the console. Game it's over just, again. It's just fun. All around, it's just fun. Game over. That was a dumb mistake on the half there. On the mama half. Bam, 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 bam. Line. Game Sucks. over. Then I get again. Sucks. Line. Game over. Again. Sorry for my very bad wub wub music. Or my very bad wub wub sounds. Line. Game over again. Wub 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 wub. There you go. Line. Game 
triangle. Oh, oh, well, oh, or I guess I'll try one time. Oh uh, yeah. I'm a cheese game. Line. Oh, cool, that's hard. Probably not someone that to mark. To me, it's hard. Triangle. It's pretty hard. Game over. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That's about it, basically. Very short edition of Indie Games of the Week. Super Hexagon. It's a pretty good game. I'd say, if you have the chance, get it. But wait till it goes on sale. It's not worth, the, I think, the $15, it says. Or is it 5 I don't know, 15 or 5 Anyways, both not worth it. Wait till it gets on sale for, like, $0.59. Cents. Like I did, and that's the worth. Anyways, that's the deal for this. Anyways, that's it, ladies and gentlemen, for... This week's edition of Indie Games of the Week, Super Hexagon. Till next time, and as always, to be continued.